get this unboxed. Check it out. See what all there is. Love our instructions. The unit itself. Ah, a little solar panel. There they are. Mounting hardware. Let's lay this all out and take it all out. Hmm. Now it does not include the batteries, so I went and got the batteries real quick. This is the mounting bracket. Basically slides on when you mount it, just like that. This will actually has no screws, you just adjust. The pivoting, they're not loose, so they'll stay there. They're pretty secure. And listen to this. I like that. That is neat. Adjust it to your specific need where you want that light to be directed. Sensors here, and you plug in the solar panel right there. Push this and it pulls out. Mount that and slide that on. It has an indicator right here that says up. So you know you're going to make sure you put it the right way. Here, you pull this tab down and pull out. And there's your batteries. Make sure you orient the batteries properly. And I don't see anything in there that states which way but because of the spring that gives me indication the flap usually goes on the spring so I got a spring on that side spring on that side and this one doesn't have spring it goes down batteries are in there are two screws that have small heads on them which are these these two are for the solar panel. You have two other ones that have a wider head. That is to mount the light. These, you need them to fit right in here. So they'll fit. The wider head screw will not. So the small head screw is for your solar panel. I did the same thing, mount the little solar panel right there. The sun always hits on this side anyway. As you see, I got the wire and plugged in the bottom, so that is now activated with the solar panel. Okay, nighttime, we're going to check and see. I noticed, I know you can't see it in the video, there is something blinking red. I'm about, about 35 feet away. I'm just making my way around. I'm on the side. Coming to the front. Coming to the front. Up, oh, right there.
it works good though yeah I'm, but I can adjust that a little bit more but this is where I want it because it lights up the container and where I park my truck between my shop and the container and stuff so anybody anything comes around here it's going to pick it up and that is bright I really like that that's good and that's going to stay lit for about two minutes I think I have it set for about two minutes so that's it you see how bright it is it lights that area up pretty good